Hey everyone, today in this video I will show you how to implement table view in Android Studio. So first of all we will open our Android Studio. We will be creating a new project. Let us say the project name is table view. Okay. Next we will be selecting it as an empty activity. Main activity. Now we are in a uh, project, so we will be opening our activity main.xml and we will go to the design. Okay, first of all, what we will do is search for relative layout. Okay, and we will be opening our component tree options relating this hello world. Okay, now we will be dragging our relative layout to here. Sorry. right now we will be searching for table view fairly simple table layout and we will drag it into the relative layout so you can see if we open relative layout then there is a table layout and we have default four rows in our table layout now what we can do we can add as many as table row in the table layout as we want it depends upon the requirement of your application or the requirement by you okay so i'm be adding like six rows now i want to add a button in my row so what will i do i will search for button yeah and i will drag the button into the table row i want so it's the first table row i will drag it into the table row one and within a minute I can see a button here so I can change the property of this button by going into properties let us name it as press me oh, no. fairly good okay now i want to add another text layer into it so i will go again back to my component tree and i want to assign a text field okay so i will go into text view and drag the text view into the table row i can swap it like this so I want to keep it next to the button so this thing okay okay this is a text view if I want to add another button so I will do button drag the button into the second table row and I can see there is another button now I want another text field so I will drag it into the table row and boom it's there okay now if I run my app let us try it and as you can see there is a button here and a button here the best thing about table view is that you don't have to add constraints to it like the position you set the buttons the button will remain at that position you don't have to set any constraint to set the button for different size screen for the different screen sizes so if i press this this will do nothing obviously done anything to the button so if i press the button it won't do anything there's no activity in it so this was everything about our table view so if you like this video please subscribe to my channel and like this video and please share it and if you have any doubts any query leave it in the comments i will get back to you thank you